Okay, in the dining room, we are coming at you with a yabo. This yabo is from a good friend of mine from Kentucky. Kenan? No, he's from Georgia. Never mind. How about scotch and pipes, Mr. Chris? So I opened it up today, earlier, we were on Voxer together. We were on Voxer together, and he wanted me to open it. He cheated. So I cheated, yes. Cheated. cheated. Um, but. Did you know that we sat down and he got himself a drink and not me? <sighs> You're killing me. I had to get up and get my own drink. She's killing me today. So anyhow, here it is. Are you ready? Can I look at it? Yeah, it's a good one too. Since you're already peaked. Just make sure nothing bites. That's not funny. Ah! Just kidding. I'm kidding. Don't hit me. I don't feel good. <laughs> In my gut. I don't feel good. It's a bro note. It's a note. He from just my, got a from he my, just got a well, let me tell you something about Chris. He, just got a he is a brother, f Scotch and pipes. Oh. He is a brother from another mother. Now you gonna rip another note? No. Hope this package and samples find you well. Enjoy, love your channel, and value your friendship. Chris, a.k.a. Scotch and Pops. I know what these are. Oh, do you now? Damn. Esoterica's Dunbar. Can you see that? Is that Dunbar or Dorchester? Dorchester? Dorchester. That's a vapor. That's a Virginian Perique blend. Okay, that's not bad. Not great. That smells good. Well, you like them all. I do like them all. I smoke them all. This I is ain't scared. Esoterica Pembroke. Mmm. That's a. That's the tin that he opened up, and like the white paper that was inside it was all tan. It's an English. It smells yeah. like beef jerky. It's an English blend. Mama don't like English. Little mama don't like English. They smell like beef jerky. When I opened up my Yorktown, when I got it last year, she says, that smells like bacon. I said, I knew there was a reason why I liked it. Esoterica. Esotericas. Esoterica. What does that say? Kingsbridge? Yep, Kingsbridge. Now that's a stoved Virginia blend. That's all Virginias. That is it's all a, black. I know, it's stoved. It's a like, wonderful. You see that? It's all black. See that? It is a see wonderful. That? Look at the difference. It is, it a, is black. It is a wonderful tobacco. So what a stove, what did you say? Stoved, stoved Virginias. Now that one smells good. Excellent. So I can order a bag? That one smells good. Shouldn't you smoke something before you just order it? I did smoke a bowl of this earlier. 
I did. I reposted it on Instagram. I got the ghost dance out and hammered down. He wanted me to smoke a bowl of it first. Because he likes it and wanted to know if I liked it. He sent it to me. So, I can't tell wait him a minute. no. So, now, look at these weird little funny bangs. Okay. So, this me and my big apparently mouth. is not a yabo. It's a yabo. It is not a yabo. It's this a box is, opening. No, it's not. The box was already opened. Apparently, this is like a review. It's not a review. It's a yabo. He sent it to me. But you already opened it and smoked it. I only smoked this one. What's a yabo? Yet another box opening. We opened the box. It was closed. You opened it. Did you open the box before? That doesn't say no. that. It never, it never spent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So that every time I take a sip, yet another sipping can. <laughs> Look at me like You're like three nuggets short of a Happy Meal. Then I'd only have one nugget. Well, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Unless I have got the six-piece nugget, then I'd have half my nuggets. <laughs> I'm going with the six-piece nugget. I have half my marbles. Ay, ay, ay. What is going on with these little bags? Look at them. I have a question for you on the, the bang theory. Okay, your bangs are out of control. Did you use your bearded assassin's beard butter this morning? I don't use it in the morning. I use it after I shower. That's why. Bam! That's why it's out of control. If you would have put just a touch of it on there, okay. giddy up, you'd have been fine. Okay. Today we went out to eat. I went. My mother-in-law picked me up, and uh, I was at work. Took me for breakfast, and. Uh, we went in there, and she goes in there all the time. So the waitresses, the waitresses know her, and uh, so we go in there, and uh, we're done eating. So she comes over, and I give her a hug and a kiss. When I went to give her a hug, she says to me, "She goes, man, she says you smell good. She goes, that's good uh, laundry detergent." I said. That's not laundry detergent that you smell. I said, that's my beard. She says, she's like, what? I said, it's my beard that smells. And your mom was like, ow. Your, it smells up there. Your mom was like, really yeah, it's his beard. Much. And uh, so we decided to, <laughs> we decided to uh, do it. So she's, she's like, man, it smells really good. And uh, so I went ahead and um, proceeded to give her one of the business cards for Bearded Assassins with the code on the back, which, by the way, the code, if you go to www.beardedassassins.com and you put uh, the code GHOST1 in caps in at checkout, you get 10% off your order. It never expires, and it's good for every order. So, um... I've tried it. Yes, yeah, she purposely tried it. So, if you, uh, go to beardedassassins.com and put in Ghost One at checkout, you save 10% on all your beard oils. Butters, bombs, whatever you want to get there. So, um... I like the butters. Check them out if you haven't already. The Hooligan is my favorite. Yes, for you to, and you like the flashbang. That's the mint chocolate chip one. It smells like a Girl Scout Thin Mint cookie. It does. It's really good. I like the hooligan one though. I know. So we're gonna do three quick shout outs here at the end. First and foremost is gonna be Scotch and Pipes. Um, Chris, thank you very much for the samples. I very much appreciate it. And uh, most importantly, brother, I appreciate your friendship. And, um, you know, I truly appreciate everything that you've done for me and uh, sending me stuff. So uh, thank you very kindly. I appreciate it. If you have not checked out Scotch and Pipes channel, please do so. Secondly, go ahead and read the second one. Is that a B? 
Yes. Sorry, you have to. So like, like a dog with a bee. Yes. Busky James. Busky James, brand new to the YTPC. I think he only has like, I think he's under twenty subs. Um, brand new to the YTPC. Found him through the Peaches. Um, Peaches. So, uh, if you haven't subbed him, look him up and give him a sub. And last but certainly not least, East Coast 30 Cow. Like I said, I will put all of the names and links in the bucket so you can find them. Have we determined what this bucket is? Yeah, it's the description box underneath. And it's called a bucket. Yes, people call it a bucket. They call it the ashtray. They call it the basement. People, some it's people. It's not like a comment box. It's no, no, yeah, they've given it different names. Oh. So. Shout out. <laughs> Here's what she's been annoying me with the whole time we've been doing this video. <laughs> She drew a turkey. No, she, it's your hand. She, yeah, my hand. And then she made it a turkey. And then she writes, gobble, gobble, gobble on it. That's and it. I'm trying to do the video, and you're like going. Because those were your shout outs. Oh, what am I going to do with you? You're supposed to gobble, gobble. <laughs> I'm supposed to gobble, gobble. Do. Gobble, gobble. No, do. Oh! There you go. Is that what you wanted? Cheese and oh, crackers, man. Cheese and crackers, you're driving me nuts. Once oh. again, we are out of control. This. Ow! <laughs> Ow! You want to talk about your judo jab slap? Would you like to share that story? I have. Oh, okay. Do you know what a judo jab slap is? No, don't. Do you? <laughs> don't. You brought it up. No. I got to demonstrate. No. No, because you hurt me last time with it. She karate chops <laughs> me. <laughs> she karate chops me in my shoulder, my ribs, and then across my face while I'm in bed. And then she slaps me across the other side of the cheek. I'm telling ya, man. It's his fault. <laughs> it's my fault. It is because I said I was going to kung fu jap slap him, uh, and he said, "There's no such thing. You're an idiot." And I went, "Oh, da, da, smack!" <laughs> and he went, Boop. "It was out of control." All right. I got something in my eye. <laughs> That's an excuse and not even a good one. <laughs> he was afraid. <laughs> oh, my word. These yamas are out of control. He was afraid. <laughs> petrified. You're going to be petrified. You're petrified. Oh. All right. Oh. Until we can get together and pack a pipe or light a good yes. cigar, let all that you do be done out of love. Y'all take care and God bless. You're so serious. Wait for it! <laughs>